richer style. Richest Hey guys, so I am back home. So I want to quickly show you guys all I got. Anyway guys, I didn't even like introduce myself when I was going anyway, so anyway I went to grocery shopping So I'm back home, I went to Lidl as usual and I also went to the African store Let me quickly show you what I got from Lidl and African store Like this one, I got it from Lidl, this is Nose White Fasoletto That's what we call it here in Italy Alright guys, this period we use that a lot because the weather is somehow I got a new biscuit, biscuit lovers, you know come aside I bought two because I feel they are very nice. Uh, oat flour. So this biscuit was done with oats, cocoa oats, oats, oats. Yeah, oats biscuits and no sugar, no sugar added. So I'm like, okay, let me try this one out. If I like it, I will continue with this one. And yeah, except for biscuits, I love to most times in the morning just take biscuits when I uh, as my breakfast and drink tea. I bought black. There you see blackberry. Blueberry. <laughs> I got blueberry, which I usually take with my yogurt. I've been seeing this that type of Nigeria shall from Amago village. They usually come with this type of bread, a small small one like that. So I've been seeing this for a very long time in the supermarket. I've been wanting to try it out. So today I bought it, so I will try it out. I think I don't know if I would like it. Yeah. Let me know in the comment section if you've ever seen this type of bread in Nigeria. <laughs> if you live in Nigeria and if you have ever seen this type of bread. Me, I remember my mom used to buy it in the good village, the corner, that kind of bread. They buy small, 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 tiny ones like that. I got bell pepper. I will use it to make stew. I don't think I'll be able to make this stew today. I'll make it tomorrow. Uh, granite oil. This is semi de girasole sunflower oil. Pancetta. Pancetta. I took uh, cotoleta, cotoleta con tacino polo. That is, top, they did it with turkey polo and some spinach. I got this one so uh, right. I decided to buy it. I got egg, and this one is toki mosquito. This one is fresh eggs. I didn't spend much anyway. I bought some fresh tomato which I'll be using to mix to see this one growing, oh my goodness. Anyway, maybe by tomorrow it will all right. Some fresh tomato to mix to broccoli. There's dry by banana, fresh some fresh fresh bananas. Let me remove it from the nylon. Take a look at that. This is how the banana look. Close look. Closer look of the banana. My blueberry. Yeah, I'll show you guys everything I got. So I bought one big bell pepper. If I want to make some um, vegetables to fry, I'll use that. I took carrots, which I'll be using to eat carrots for food with my banana soup that I'll be cooking. I bought potato, this is Irish potatoes, one kg, one kilogram. What else did we have here? Lastly, I have yogurt. Okay, so I bought my usual, usual Greek yogurt. So this is everything I got today, you guys. This is every, everything. From the African store, let me show you all I got from the African store. These are dry fish. Let me put them in a bowl to show you guys properly. So, some dry fish. So guys, dry fish. I bought dry fish, I'll be 
I have some left, but I decided to just buy this one. She sold this one for 20 euro. Let me know in the comment section if it's cheap or if it's, if it's too expensive. Just let me know what you think about that dry fish. I took the arm which I'll be using to make pepper soup. Okay, some goat meat pepper soup. I asked her to cut it this way because make her know whether the yam good inside or not good. Okay, I took two of it. I can't really tell how much I got this one. I don't feel I don't feel remember again. So these are the yam. What else did you buy from the African store? Tin tomato, the rica, the rica. What else? Banga palm fruits in English. Banga palm fruits. Okay, so I'll be making banga soup right away. So I took that. And lastly, from the African store, some fresh pepper. So this is everything I got today, guys, from Lidl and from the African store. Okay, I am very hungry. It's past 11. I've not taken breakfast. I want to make tea and I'll be trying that biscuit. Yeah, so I'll carry you guys along. Yeah, don't forget to subscribe. Give the video a thumbs up. Uh, thank you for clicking. My name is Rachel. I'm a lifestyle vlogger. I create lifestyle content. Please subscribe. Give me a huge thumbs up and let me see you in my next clip. Yeah.
Jesus, now bless us and find the blood of Jesus in Jesus' name. I pray and thank you for providing this for you. God, I appreciate you. All the Lord should provide for those that don't have to give you all the glory in Jesus' name. Amen. Join me, guys. It's another mukbang eating show challenge. I'll be eating uh, carrot fufu made with oatmeal and banga soup, aka I'm not banga soup with goat meat. Fish, top fish, and dry fish. Join me, guys. This is yummy already. Mm. Tastes good. It's always better when the light is on. Yeah. So you guys, I went to work this morning and I am back home. I could not make the stew yesterday, so I'm going to be making the stew today. So this is the next day. So let me start making the stew. I already have my goat meat here. It's almost cooked and I will start making the stew. I blended my tomatoes. Let me show you guys. If you're new here, thank you for clicking. Don't forget to subscribe and give the video a huge thumbs up. Yeah. These are my tomatoes. I just blended them. Yeah, I have the good meat is cooking. Yeah, I'll start making my stew. I just had my oil. Okay. 